God's presence to witness and celebrate the marriage of Joel and Mia and to ask God to bless them so they may be strengthened for their new life together as one. God gave us marriage for the full expression of love between a man and a woman so that husband and wife may cherish and delight in one another, comfort and help each other in sickness, trouble, sorrow, provide for each other, pray for and encourage each other in the things that pertain to God and to live together faithfully for all of their days. Love is patient. Love is kind, it is never jealous. Love is never boastful or conceited. It's never rude or selfish. Love does not take offense and is not easily troubled. Love takes no pleasure in other people's faults, but delights in the truth. It's always ready to excuse, to trust, to hope. It's always ready to endure whatever comes. And true love does not come to an end. Well, Joel, Mia, marriage is a precious gift. It's a lifelong dedication to love, and it's a daily challenge to love one another fully freely and unconditionally. You, Joel, take Mia to be your beloved wife. You promise before God and these witnesses to be a tender and faithful husband. You promise to love and cherish her in sickness and in health, for richer or for poorer, for better or for worse, and promise to keep yourself only unto her. If so, say, I do. I do. And Mia, with that same understanding, do you take Joel to be your beloved husband? Do you promise before God and these witnesses to be a tender and faithful wife? Do you promise to love and cherish him in sickness and in health, for richer, for poorer, for better or for worse, and promise to keep yourself fully unto him? If so, look into his eyes and say, I do. I do. Now, Joel, as you take her ring and you place it on her left ring finger, please look into her eyes and repeat after me. If God is my witness, God is my witness. I give you this ring, give you this ring. wear upon your hands as a symbol, symbol of my endless commitment of my endless commitment and my love for you my love for you now as you place the ring on Joel's ring finger please look into his eyes and repeat after me with God as my witness with God as my witness I give you this ring I give you this ring to wear upon your hand to wear upon your hand as a symbol as a symbol of my endless commitment of my endless commitment and my love for you and my love for you and so by the power vested in me by the will of Christ, I declare, Joel and Mia, you are now husband and wife, according to the ordinance of God, the laws of the state, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. As the power of God has joined the two of you together in love, let no one part you. May the grace of Christ attend you, may the love of God surround you, and may the Holy Spirit keep you. You may live in faith, abound in hope, and grow in love, both now and forever. You may now kiss your bride. After you guys got engaged, I was excited. I know that Joel is better off with you than without you. 
Joel, I am insanely proud of you, and I think you're doing a great job, and I can't wait to see where this goes next. Congratulations to me and Joel. I'm so happy for you guys. I met the bride about 10 years ago. Mia has always had a very welcoming energy. She's the kind of friend that from the moment you meet her, it feels like you've known her your whole life. But looking back at the 10 years I have known her, a lot of my favorite memories have been with Mia. In what I think was in the beginning of 2022, and she texted me that she was moving in with a guy, which was very big news. When I visited their house in St. Martinville for the first time, I have to admit I was very shocked. I did not recognize my best friend. But truly in the best way, Mia Leger had actually settled down. She had finally found our fourth wheel. From what I could see, Joel had stepped into the role as Big Papa so effortlessly. From experience, I know there can be a very unique bond between a girl and her stepdad. And I also know that Joel has and will continue to be such a positive influence on our sweet girl. From the outside looking in, I think me and Joel have learned a lot from each other. Joel is logical and helps Mia to look at the big picture. And Mia is very passionate and has big dreams. And together they make a great team. They are incredibly caring, loyal, and supportive of each other. Me and Joel, it may not always be easy, but if you choose each other every single day, it will be worth it. I know you two will continue to build a very beautiful life together. So to end, a toast to the boat loss. It's my mom, but she used to be sick, but now she figured it out. She said that she's having a baby. <laughs> I'm going to be a good sister. I take the road less traveled. Yeah, I choose my battles. Oh, you know that's who I am. I've come unraveled I've had cages rattled Oh, this is where we stay
This is the moment 